Welcome to This Week in Wimberley. I'm Chris Daly. I will be joined shortly by Mr. Z, Gary Zupancic. Uh, this is a show where we talk about what's going on in and around the Wimberley Valley, all the fun stuff. We will get to that in just a moment. But first, quick message from some people who made this show possible. Clean Tanks is a local, family-owned, full-service rainwater collection tank and well collection tank cleaning company based right here in Wimberley, Texas, but serving the entire Texas Hill Country. They service tanks from 1,000 gallons up to 200,000 gallons. They designed and built a wet vacuum system that removes all the dirt and sediment from inside the tank, all with very little water loss. As always, your satisfaction is 100% guaranteed. You can call Clean Tanks at 512-806-3322. You spent a lot of money on this water collection system. Make sure your tank is a clean tank. All right, everybody join me in welcoming Mr. Z, Gary Zipancic. How are you doing, Gary? Oh, doing great. The weather, although it's been a little gloomy and rainy, we will appreciate that when we're in August instead of yep. not having it. So really, this weekend is the beginning, the first weekend of the month, and that means market days. And market days uh, really has over 400. I didn't realize this. I was talking to a friend. They have over 450 vendors, and mm-hmm. now the parking lot across the street has Wi-Fi, so you can park across the street and pay with a credit card. Nice. You know, it used to be you had to take cash, you know. Yeah. And, you, and really, you want to save your cash for, when you go inside, you know. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, yeah, that, that's a pretty good deal. Uh, I was really, really uh, really amazed they're able to do that sometimes, but, hey, that's just technology. You know, and since it's the first weekend of Winders Wimberley, a house is open. And it's the mm-hmm. home of the Wimberley Valley Museum. Uh, Friday and Saturday, of the mo- first of the month, they uh, – will go both days, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. with a docent there. Mm-hmm. So that's pretty cool. You know, uh, the City of Wimberley Parks and Recreation Department will host a community-wide garage sale this Saturday at the Community Center, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. I know a lot of ladies like go shopping at that. And yeah. that was a, you know, I really didn't hear too much about it, but it was like, you know, hey, if, if there's lots of lots of people like there like to go to garage sales and that type of stuff, so... Uh, I think this. I think this is their first one. Uh, of course, we always had that Friday night bingo at the uh, VFW Post, uh, 401 Jacobs Well Road, Doors Concessions uh, at 6:30, early bingo seven, BYOB regular game start at eight, and that's right on uh, Jacobs Well Road. Uh, this is just really a highlight for next week. May 11th and 12th is Rolling Oaks Music Festival, mm-hmm. and that's been that's been going on for a while. So I thought it was just a heads up. Uh, Doubt a Parable is uh, playing at the Wimberley Playhouse. Uh, tickets are $25. And it's a pretty in-depth uh, drama about, uh, I guess, the cat. well, no, I don't guess. It's about the Catholic Church. And uh, it happens during the uh, 60s. And mm-hmm. actually, uh, it's uh, the conservatives against the liberal. And it's, it's pretty, it's really drama, big-time well, drama, I guess. There's only four actors, too. And uh, people that have seen it have said it's, it's amazing. So uh, that's going on. Uh, of course, this weekend is the big the KWVH's third annual derby party, 2.30 to 6. And it's indoors this year. It's the Vidier Estate uh, uh, in, in Wimberley. And along with the 150th Run, Run for the Roses, uh, mm-hmm. we, this, is, this is the radio station's big event. In fact, they even have a uh, Taylor Swift package uh, two nights. <laughs> Indianapolis, uh, two or I think four tickets up there to uh, see her live and sign guitar by her too. I mean, it's and it really it's really a good cause because yes, I am on the radio, but also we do a lot of community stuff. In fact, uh, yeah. at my show at the Hitchin Post, uh, we try to have list local members that are really really interesting, and uh, you know that's that's what we do. I mean, I would I hate to do those pledge things. <laughs> I worked at yeah. PS in Houston, and we are always just doing pledges. So uh, I guess there's a few uh, spots left. So that's kwvh.org, and you find all your information. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Starlight Symphony Orchestra is presenting Film Fun on uh, the 4th and the 5th of their Pops concert at the Wimberley Valley Winery 
uh, in Driftwood. And uh, let's, oh, the May 5th concert is at Wimberley First Baptist Church. Okay. So this is what's really cool. The program includes music from the Dances of the World, Star Wars, Back to the Future, Stranger Things, Aladdin, Pirates of the Caribbean, Game of Thrones, the Barbie movie, and Avengers uh, Endgame. Listeners are encouraged to dress up as their favorite characters. Nice. So I know a lot of people, you know, like to come to Wimberley and be seeing different people. But that's mm-hmm. this is a big chance to do both uh, May 4th and May 5th, okay? Nice. So the farmer's market uh, by the Cowboy Church across from the fire station on Red on Green Acres, fresh produce and crafts, Thursday, 6, p, 6 to excuse me, 3 to 6 p.m. Junction's Farmer Market is Sunday, 10 to 2, and the Blanco Brew Farmer's Market, 9 to 2. And, of course, we're talking about Blanco Brew, and, hey, this is the first of the month, so you have coffee and cars. And mm-hmm. it's, it's amazing. I, you know, I didn't know. And really, I you know, I, there's no fees or anything else, but I guess, but people just bring their cars and park them, and there's some really, really awesome cars out there. Yeah. So. I remember saying, you know, back in February, hey, things are going to pick up. Things are going to pick up on the weekends. Well, they have. They're just yeah. so much. There's just so much going on. Uh, of course, Wimberley, come for the music. Stay for the charm. Uh, here's bands. Thursday, May the 2nd. Gail Patrick at KWVH uh, Patio at 10.15. Tip Jar, 6 p.m. at Ponderosa. 6 p.m. Jesse Stratton, band of Hay City Store. And that's a, that's a really good venue in I love Jesse's a, a good friend. So, yeah. uh, 7 p.m. Music Fest at Fisher Hall. Uh, then on Friday, 10 15, Nate Harris at the KWVH patio. 12 p.m. Music Festival at Fisher, Fisher Hall. 4 p.m. Hill Country Honeys at the Wimberley Valley Winery. 5 p.m. Mr. Boulevard at Ghost Note. 5 p.m. Marvin Matera with Lee Conister at Willow Lake. And that's the new one that's on Oak Isle Road. Mm-hmm. In fact, I was going to the radio station. I, I watched them build that place. And said, "How are they ever going to get an event out of that little place?" And they did. Yeah. It's <laughs> it's pretty. Uh, Seven p.m. Black Saddle at Savages. Uh, Saturday, May fourth, all day. Little Beverly in the Shades at Market Days Pavilion Stage. Also, Alias Newman at the Market Days Shady Grove Stage, and Meg Groves at at the Market Days Hilltop Stage. 12 p.m., Caps End of the Year at Hay City Store. 12 p.m., Music Festival at Fisher Hall. 1 p.m., Aston Naylor at Henson Square. 4 p.m., Brandon Pettier at uh, and Black Gold at Ghost Hook. 7 p.m., Broken Arrow at Hay City Store. 7 p.m., Sean Slater at Dos Olivos. 8 p.m., Gus Miller at Mercer Street. Sunday, May 5th, 11 a.m., Music Fest at Fisher Hall. 1 p.m., Two Tons of Steel at Devil's Backbone. 3 p.m., Anthony Garcia at Ghost Note. 3 p.m., Tumbleweed, yeah, Tumble, Tumbleweed Hill at Mercer Street. 6 p.m., Rye Mountain Revelry at Hay City Store. Monday, 10.15 a.m., Dan Figgins at the KWVH patio. 5 p.m., River Mountain Green at Savages. 6 p.m., 10,000 Bees at Hay City Store. 6 p.m., Open Mic at Middleton Brewery. 7.30 p.m., James McMurtry, it's sold out at the Wimberley Playhouse. And that's, uh, you know, that's one of those really intimate co- uh, concerts. And you get right down in there. In fact, Sarah Jerome's did it. just uh, blew everybody away. Uh, Tuesday, May 7th, Jack Henry at the KWVH patio, 6 p.m. Manny Velasquez at Hay City Store. Wednesday, 10, 15 a.m. Conjunto, Conjunto, it's Kanhuto and Jazz put together. Kanhuto, <laughs> uh, Joel Guzman, and Sarah at the KWVH patio. 5.30, Byron Batera's Song Swap at Willow Lake. 6 p.m., Jamie Balderas at Hay City Store. And 6.30, Song Circle at Savages. At Savages. And this week, uh, for our interesting band uh, person, we have singer Colleen Michelle Miller with Amarillo Rain. Keep telling 
mixing things up. Uh, it's been a while since we've had a uh, female on there. Yeah, I agree. I agree. And with the rain going on, hey, you know, yeah. it was a sure, it was a sure bet. <laughs> oh, so, so the nonprofit of the week is, of course, KWVH 94.3 or KWVH.org. Uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a sustain, sustaining member because I like to give a little bit each month, and that way I, I know at least I'm helping a little bit. Yeah. Uh, but really, you know, there's amazing things that we do. In fact, it really sort of surprised me. This our last person was uh, our last guests were uh, <clears throat> Carmen Polhemus and uh, Nancy Kyle, and they were mm-hmm. from the Wimberley, believe it or not, Cemetery Association. And really, we laughed the entire time. Uh, you know, and really, we're talking about how many people, uh, how many plots they have, and they still have some, they have more plots. But I couldn't believe it. I got. I got a uh, pass on the back from everybody because I th- I guess we took a really morbid subject and we were able to explore it and we were able to laugh about it. So, yeah, I, it, it's in the archives at kwvh.org. Uh, but, yeah, our big, like I said, our big fundraiser is uh, this weekend. If you want to look for a little bit of inc- excitement, uh, there are a few uh, spots left. So you get all that at k 
kwbh.org. So that's all I got about Chris. I'm, you know, I'm hoping we have a little bit uh, break in the rain so we can get out mm-hmm. and uh, fool around. But hey, it's I'm not knocking it. Yeah, I I, uh, I have to mention that May is Mental Health Awareness Month. So get out there and enjoy all the fun stuff that's going on in Wimberley, and that will do so much for your mental health. Yeah, get your get your face out of the screen and go and look yeah. at some tricks, you know? I love it. All right. Well, cool. Thanks so much, Gary. We'll be talking right, next talk, week. Talk to you next week. You have a good one. Have you ever thought about doing your own podcast? It is the absolute best way to grow your brand, spread your message, and build your following. Fresh Media Works can help. We do all the heavy lifting, and you just focus on your message. To find out how easy we can make launching your new podcast, call 713-269-4620 or check us out at freshmediaworks.com. As always, I want to thank Gary for sitting down with me. I want to thank you guys for tuning in, for giving us what I consider the most important and valuable gift you can give, and that is your time and your attention. Go out there and participate in your city. Participate in all the great events going on in the city and tell us about it on your Facebook groups, on your Twitter, anywhere you have friends, share it out.